Hi, I'm Joseph. In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect this ESP8266 based Node MCU to this relay module. Now let's see the relay. It's an electrical switch. It's used to isolate the input circuit and an output circuit. In the input circuit, there are six pins. Two of them are power pins and the rest four are input pins. When we give input to one of these four, the relay will give power to the output device accordingly. The NodeMCU and IoT de devices make the input side and the output device is the output side. Now let's see the output side. One channel has three pins. The middle one is called COM and it's the power supply. The other two goes to the output device and this is called normally open and this is called normally closed. Usually normally open is used because when we give a high input to the input side the relay will turn the load the turn the output device off and when we give a low signal it will turn the output device on there's one more thing to remember is that the power supply circuit of the input side should be different from that of the output side now let's see a real circuit with the relay this is the power supply module this is the node mcu which is also an IoT device. This is the relay module and this is the output device and that's an LED. The power supply module can act as two different power supplies. This is set to 5 volt to drive the node MCU and the relay's input side. This is set to 3.3 volt to drive the relay's output side. I have written a simple program so that when I short these two wires the node MCU will recognize it and then send a signal to the relay's input side and the input side will drive the output side and finally the LED will go on. So I am going to short these two. For detailed circuit diagram, you can visit my blog. Link is given right below this video. So, thanks for watching.